Yeah. Hey, this week was not a good week in uh, high school sports, especially in Chicago, which is really a shock, you know. Here, I'm going to give you four things here that happened just this week. Uh, Curry went to Michigan City to play in the game. The coach got a technical, didn't like it, walked off the floor. Michigan City gets a forfeit win. They came back on the floor and wanted to get back in the game. <laughs> It was too late. It's all taken right. care of. I got a story up on it. You can check it out. But that Curry guy, I don't know, Michael Oliver, I think is his name. Okay. 2000, 2007, 2014, he's pulled stunts like this. Yeah. And he's still coaching. Yeah. So, and they got knocked off their next game, which I really felt sorry for him. Also, the Morgan Park fiasco, you've mm-hmm. heard about that. Did you hear that they also scheduled the game the same night they were supposed to play Chicago Vocational? <laughs> so, CPS was going to give them a forfeit for the Vocational game. Right. Because they got the game at home at Morgan Park. Morgan Park says, no, we're not going to take a, a forfeit for that. Yeah? Well, how are you going to do that? You're going to play right. two games? We don't want to play two games. Well, you're the one that got yourself in right. the game. You should have looked. Right. You know, you're not they're not the one changing the schedule you are and the other team vocational already changed their schedule to meet Morgan Park's requirement, okay? Right. This is all at CPS. The other one is last night Leo at Seton. I think our friend Jack Gleason was there, Michael Bryan was there. They must have had a brawl in the handshake line, you know, kind of like oh, yeah. that we had here a couple of years ago. They had police squads everywhere. They were blocking off. They had to sneak Michael Bryan out of the gym. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's three things in uh, the Chicago related. I mean, they're nuts. Let's yeah. face it, they're nuts. The state wants to take them over. I don't know why anybody would want them, but they got to do something about Chicago public schools. Although uh, Craig Anderson is looking into the new uh, IHSA guy is looking into the Michigan City forfeit, mm-hmm. and they're also looking into the recruiting practices. So he is at least taking a step forward, a positive. Right. My hat's off to him. At least they're talking about doing something. Well, you know. I- It'll be interesting to see what what comes of these things because one of two things will happen. I know, I know people in Chicago have talked about breaking away from the IHSA before. Uh, Good idea. They, you know, they, they <laughs> might this might be what spurs them on to do something like that, or the IHSA might, uh, you know, finally put some rules down there. Yeah. You, you know, I mean, I guess one of two things will happen. You'll either get some rules put down in place, maybe that that'll affect that area, or they'll just finally say, you know what. We, we've had enough of you. You've had enough of us. So well, let's just end this. Yeah, you mean we got to go by rules? That's what I can just right. say. And then that. right. that's the stuff we know about. That, right. That makes me a little nervous. Right. And the Morgan Park is a lot of parents in interference in there. Yeah. So that's all I'm going to say on that. Okay. In Indiana, in the Indianapolis girls game, a player did not like a foul situation. A new girl came in, and a brawl started out in the middle of the game. They forfeited both teams. Bobby Cox, the commissioner for the IHSAA, said, okay, you guys are done. Mm-hmm. You're not going to play any more games. You're out of the tournament. Last year they did that to a team, but the courts came in and overruled and let the team sure. play in the tournament. But at least they take a really hard stance on that. But I'll tell you what, you've been around girls basketball. Mm-hmm. They don't mess around. No, not at all. They're very serious when yeah. they play. And it was a big fight. It's a big YouTube thing right Yeah. Now. Isn't that, isn't that great for high school sports this week? <laughs> I'm lucky where we're at. We're, right. We have some really good kids around. Yeah, here. we do. We do.